Hello everyone and welcome to another Feed Army video. My name is Manuel and today we will discuss an issue related to super admins in Google Merchant Center next. Now what happened is when you're in Google Merchant Center Classic and you migrated to next or you are not the person that have migrated to next then that person who clicked on the button to migrate has become the super admin. Now that should have not happened if for example there are multiple admins within that account. For example in my case I manage lots of different accounts and I am just an admin so that I can do my daily tasks. However the real store owner is actually my client and that is absolutely fine. However for some reason now if we go to the cog icon people and access we will notice that I have become a super admin and that should not have happened. It's actually my client should have been super admin. So before in Google Merchant Center Classic, what happened is you were just an admin uh, alongside the other people. Uh, now it seems like I'm the super admin and now I've checked multiple accounts and I'm the super admin in all accounts. This causes issues with not being able to remove other users and also issues where you cannot link, uh, for example, apps from Shopify uh, to Google Merchant Center next. So what we need to do is we need to go and click on Manage in Business Manager. So as I am an agency, I ensure that all my clients are the owner. So what I need to do now is go and click on Manage, Add Access, change them to Super Admin. And what will happen is they will receive an email to accept the invitation to become a, a super admin. So this is actually a quite big problem because lots of agencies will have access to their clients and mostly the clients will not access the Google Merchant Center account to do the migration or make any changes. That is mostly done by agencies. So if you have, for example, a bad actor that has changed your account to be uh, Google Merchant Center next, they might decide not to give you the super admin access. However, if that is the case, I highly recommend that you contact Google support because this is a big issue. Now for everybody, regardless if you are an agency or if you're an individual person that owns your account, especially the client owner, you need to check what your access level is. Make sure that you're the super admin so that you don't have any f issues in the future. Do this now because now it's fresh in everybody's mind of, oh, okay, it's because we migrated to GMC next. This is caused by that setup. So now the business manager setup is actually for stores. So if you have physical stores, not sure why Google decided to add this feature because it's not really necessary to be uh, a super admin to make all the necessary changes, but I'm sure there is a, a reason. So again, go to Google Merchant Center uh, next. Make sure you go to the cog icon, click on people and access and check that you, the real owner, is the super admin. And I recommend that you do that now so that you can ask whoever is the super admin to follow the steps by clicking on manage in business manager or you can share this video and then uh, set it to super admin for the real owner. That's it for this video. I recommend that you contact Google Ads if you have any issues or you can also go to the Google Ads community and I will add the link in the description and you can express your uh, situation. And uh, if you cannot fix it with uh, Google Merchant Center support, then we can escalate it if you have a case ID so that Google can look deeper into this. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.